Hello everybody, how's it going? Welcome to the new year, and thank you guys for an amazing 2019. Yeah! So uh, we're starting off this year with Kirby Star Allies again, because everybody seemed to love this series. So this is like kind of our road to uh, 100%. Yeah! Because we need to get all the puzzles completed, I guess? I'm now that sure. we've practically finished everything else, so... <laughs> like, Jesus. Star Slam Heroes and Chop Champs. Yeah, so we wanted... I think... People were, or one of our subscribers, I can't remember his name, unfortunately. He he loved this series so much and was like, commented like every video. But he said we should just do guest star allies because there's a lot of interesting characters we can use. Right. So yeah. we'll probably just do that. Um, Sounds good. So we can do new game. I think I had been playing as the Mage Sisters. I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, yeah that's you right. Because you got the crown on yeah. it. Yeah. And also the bomb guy. We also have one on there too. Right. So. Exactly. So, I mean, I guess you'll be playing as just any ordinary character, and I'll be playing as the first one. I'm just trying to figure right. out who we should use. Right. Hmm. <laughs> Gooey. <laughs> who, oh, me? <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Blah, blah, blah. They're just so cute. Because I've heard, like, a lot of these characters have, like, a lot of uh, different levels compared to, like, the normal ones. So right. I wonder if, um... You know, I really like Megalore, so I should okay. choose him. Yeah. Ooh, that's cool. That's like a throwback to Return to Dreamland. Yeah, that's cool. That was like a, a Wii game. Ooh. We should have played that like a long time ago when I was recording stuff on my Wii because we played like the... We played Kirby's Epic Yarn like so long ago. That was right. a lot of fun. Oh yeah, I forgot that uh... <laughs> shooting shit. Oh, I gotta find like a power for you. Oh yeah. I'm trying to remember. I think it's this button. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so I can just do go. that. Oh, you can just join with L and R. Oh. Oh, oh, hey, you can be him too. Okay. Well, <laughs> sweet, works. even better. <laughs> that, that makes sense. Woo, I'm just teleporting everywhere. Wee! Lying around. <laughs> as Megalore. Oops, that's the wrong button. You know, honestly, we really miss playing this game. And it was nice to see so many people support this series. Yeah. I think a lot of people that subscribed to us in 2019 were because of this series. Right. Everybody seemed to really like it. We gotta make sure we get all the puzzle pieces. We gotta get 100%. Get everything. Yeah. I don't think, like, we might have to do, like, a couple of these stories to get, like, all the puzzles completed, because we have a lot of pieces still to get, so... Oh, yeah. And I think some of them, like, we miss... I may have missed in, like, the story mode, like, those big, uh, red ones that I'll probably have oh. to get on my own, but... Oh, probably. Yeah. Ow. I think I might have went back when we were, like, after we finished the game and grabbed some of the ones I was missing anyway, so... Oh, okay. Might be okay there, but... Right. Yeah. So yeah, we hope you guys are like really excited to watch us play this again, even if it, like we're just doing guest or allies. Because honestly, like, oh yeah, oh hey, okay, so that that works. Fire. Yep. <laughs> I had a lot of practice with Megalore when we were doing the other stuff. Oh yeah, when we were doing like the ultimate choice stuff. Yeah. Fuck, man, I cannot believe we actually beat like Soul Melter EX like on the first try. <laughs> yeah, right. That was ridiculous. Yeah, even Kirby looked like he was gonna shit his pants. In yeah, that. flying away. Cause the the final battle was like so scary. Cause I had no idea what to expect out of that. Right. <laughs> and like the audio in that episode sucks, which just makes me so mad. <laughs> but I honestly really love that. Like it just, I felt right. so accomplished. Okay. Ooh, hang on. It may not be like the hardest thing. Oh, how the hell do we get that? Uh... There's gonna be some way you can do that. Nope. Hmm. Ah. Oh, it, maybe that'll work because it goes through the wall. There we go. Ah. Boom! <laughs> Just rocks flying everywhere. Blowing shit up. <laughs> that was so sick. Oh, now my turn. <laughs> right. Get to hold it. Oh yeah. There right. you go. Right, right, right. Uppercut the shit out of it. <laughs> Shoryuken. Woo! Oh, there's one down here too. Ooh. Oh, that one's really far away though. How the <laughs> fuck do you get that? I have no idea. Oh, let's try right. Oh, oh sorry. That was okay. my fault. Yeah, I tried uh, to here. like off screen, but it didn't seem to hit it. Oh, it's still too far away. It fall Okay, it falls the thing. Fuck, yeah. Ah! I did not see those guys respawn. There's got to be a way with him to do that. I think he... Oh, okay. I oh, guess that yeah, worked. Okay. I'm not even sure what happened there. It just blew up. I was gonna... I'm not even sure what I did. <laughs> I was going to use the ultimate, and I was like, would that work? Yeah, it probably would have because it goes through everything, doesn't oh, it? Oh yeah, I think so. Yeah. Oh, I should have. Here, I need to kiss you. Come okay. here. I need to kiss myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I still got damaged. 
What happened? That, that's what 2019 is all about, loving yourself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was just thought about damaging life. <laughs> oh, I see. Nice. There we go. There, health up. There, Yay. that fully heals you. Ooh, Defense what's in this up. door? <gasps> is, it, is it a doorway to Narnia? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wasn't that in, like, a cabinet or something? Whoa, what the hell? <laughs> oh, my God. It's all black and white. <laughs> it's Kirby Noir. Yeah. <laughs> this is fucking Kirby with this, like, detective hat on. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> Crossover with Detective Pikachu. <laughs> Kirby has this deep voice. <laughs> He's smoking a cigarette. <laughs> <laughs> voice by, uh, <laughs> Hugh Jackman. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Hugh Jackman. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be hilarious, holy <laughs> fuck. That would be. Oh my god, the fourth wall breaking. That oh would my have. fucking god. <laughs> it's just Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> he just has to do everything. Like every Nintendo franchise. Right? I still have to watch Detective Pikachu, man. You lent that to me like in <laughs> December and I still haven't watched it. <laughs> holy fuck. <laughs> I, I keep hearing so many good things about it. Like, my wife, Chantal, like, uh, oh, right, we gotta absorb the boat here. Or, oh. like, get in the boat. Get on! Come on! <laughs> Stupid CPU, get in the boat! Jump in the boat! Fucking idiot. There we go. <laughs> here we go! But, uh, yeah, Chantal went and saw it in theaters, and she just fucking loved it. It is a really good movie. She's like, I was so surprised at how good it was. Right? Oh. I think everybody was, actually. Like, when I first saw the trailer for it, I was just like, I don't know how I feel about this. <laughs> this yeah. is kind of weird. I really enjoyed... Oh, oh yeah, person. we need another person. There we go. Good thing they gave you another. Yeah. They always tend to give you one there, which is good, so... Oh, yeah. So you can't get locked out of progress. Oh, is it the train? The it friend is. train! <laughs> Look at his run. He's just like... Uh, <laughs> just kind of wobbling. <laughs> we the train sections. Just like shred our way through all these happy as fuck waddle dudes. <laughs> right? They're just rolling around and we're just going through them, just killing all of them. Just ruin their lives and their day. Yeah. <laughs> they really should make a Kirby movie though. They they should. Like, it'd be so easy, I think. I, I kind of feel like it would, and then I wonder is like, would they make it animated or would they make it live action? They would they would have to make it animated. I, I, like if it was like CG or something, it would be pretty awesome. Yeah. Um, because, like, they wouldn't have to have him talk, like, the cartoon and stuff. Right. And, and, like, if it was kind of similar to Right Back At You, which I never really watched a lot of. I did. But, uh, it'd be kind of interesting, I think. Oh, I yeah, know. agreed. They did a lot of interesting things in that show. I'm trying to remember, there was, like, there was one episode that I remember specifically where they were animating or something. Oh, I can't remember. It, they worked, like... We were working with some company to like animate something and it was just like it was really interesting. Uh oh. I haven't seen the show in so long though, but yeah, they had like they too. had like just, like a bunch of different art styles for the characters and stuff, like during it or something, I think. And it was so cool. So creative. Right? Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. Get to destroy fucking wispy woods again. Like always. This poor tree. Wow, we just He just gets wrecked through him. Oh, I was floating. <laughs> I was floating too. Come on, man. Just light him on fire. He's weak against fire. Oh shit. Got a block. Oh yeah, I'm invisible. <laughs> I forgot you could do that with Megalore. You can also just use his uh, Megalore's like oh, donut yeah. hole ability there. The to... donut hole. His anus hole. <laughs> <laughs> it sucks up all the apples, and if you just sit under it, it's like an umbrella. <laughs> right. That's very cool. I like that ability. Oh, yeah. I remember when, like, the CPU was using it when we were playing Soul Melter, I think. Oh, yeah. Um, I used it a lot, too. It was too. very helpful. I used it a lot, too, and it actually defended me from a lot of abilities as well. Great. Ooh. Oh, yeah, we can burn all this shit. Yeah, we can break the nuts. I think he has a sword ability. I'm trying to remember if it was, like, down up. Yeah, it was. Okay, yeah. there we go, and it chops it down. Oh, okay. I thought you had to just burn the nuts. Ooh. <laughs> Nice, chopping those Talk nuts. about burning my nuts off, what the hell? Gotta burn them I got I kinda need those. <laughs> <laughs> oh cool, I can even do it backwards. Puzzle piece, <laughs> nice. <gasps> Giant star, how do we get? I think it's just in the trees, it's just in the background. It's oh, I thought Wait, we there's a there's a key. We need a key somewhere. Need a key? It's probably up here somewhere. Oh, fuck. Ow. Yeah, it's probably in this thing. Down up. apples. Huh. There we go, I chopped it. Oh, there is that we the go. key? Yes, it is, sweet. Oh, you got it, sweet, thank you. Oh, I thought you got it. <laughs> yeah, you're good. Like, oh, you're the yellow over. one, I'm the blue one. 
Right. Because blue is the best color. It is. Eh. Even though my favorite color ah. is actually pink, but... <laughs> Alright, get... Grab it! Damn it, Megalore! <laughs> you keep floating it! <laughs> oh, jeez. It won't let me grab it! There we go. Float up. Okay. Yeah, he's kind of floaty. It's like, he kind of flies everywhere. Like, when he's in the <laughs> air, he's especially fast. Right? He's <laughs> just like, holy shit! Ooh. Oh, we gotta start shit on fire. Okay, so... We can do it with him. We gotta we gotta float our way up to the top and get down there. Ow! Uh, there we go. Okay, now in the cannons. Everybody, Everybody get in, in there. The fuck in <laughs> the, get in the fucking cannon, Megalore! <laughs> Hurry up! I can't! There, there we go. go. <laughs> that was God. so close. You get in into like the last second or something. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Yeah, he's really like hard to control when he's in the air. He is. <laughs> that was really funny. <laughs> <laughs> They're not giving us enough puzzle pieces. We need more than this. Right? Yay! Attack Yay. level 3. I'm pretty sure there's a level we can farm. I, I need to go back in the older episodes that we did and find that one specific comment that he made about what level is easy to farm. Um, but I know specifically he wanted more like guest star allies, so that's okay. why we're doing it. I hope you guys, right. was, this is what you wanted anyway. <laughs> more guest stars! Cause we're probably gonna be going back to Super Mario and stuff eventually, and like oh, River, yeah. River City Girls, especially if you guys want to see that, and like just let us know right. for sure. Ooh, I forgot about the dash. Yeah, the dash is awesome. It, you can just go through like everything with it. He is so overpowered. We should be facing like more powerful versions of these enemies. Right. Because <laughs> like, damn. Oh, actually, we should uh, get, get the painter. Yeah. Instead of burning Leo, we don't need yeah. him. We got fire abilities already, and then she can like make shit for us. Like puzzle pieces. Yeah! Yay. That's what we need. Swipe that shit. Like, oh, there's oh, another one. Ooh. <gasps> Get the button. What's that button? Ooh, oh my god, holy shit. <laughs> That's I a lot of health. Okay. <gasps> another Ooh, one. Another one. Yay! This is how we farm. Hell yeah, dude. Just call her Farmer Joes. <laughs> Farmer Joes. Farmalore. Farmalore. <laughs> Farmalore! I love it. There we go. Spirit Dash! Ooh, a Bugsy. She's gonna fucking bench press the shit out of us. <laughs> right? <laughs> He's not the original Bugsy. No. <laughs> the Sega Genesis one. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Bugsy. Oh my god. <laughs> or Bubsy or whatever the fuck's name is. The uh, Bubsy the Cat. Yeah, Bubsy. That's what god. it was, actually. I can't believe they released two new games for that fucking series. <laughs> like, just why? <laughs> I oh, to... right, okay, so I can go ahead and summon everybody in the boat. Oh, here. yeah, everybody in the boat. Oh, wow, that's like two attack powers. Oh, it just sucks you guys in there. Yeah, I had to actually get in, but. Nice. <laughs> just sacrifice us, and then you get the loot. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you guys came back. We just, just went like, off screen. We're just like, bye. You're just in another dimension. <laughs> <laughs> we just end up in the final level, and you're just like chilling in the first one. Yeah. I can't even progress because oh, I don't have what's my that? What's that? Go back. What? There's stuff up here. Oh, yeah, there's, there's a heart. heart. I keep forgetting they hide stuff behind those. Oh, yeah. Which is really cool. Yeah. Destroy the Waddle Dees! I think there might be something in I'm these. just wrecking this guy. <laughs> <laughs> he's just joggling over the corner. <laughs> With the, he's just like, let me die! <laughs> he's like, please! Now I'm doing the same thing to the pig. <laughs> oh, my God. Anybody want roast Waddle Dee? <laughs> I wonder, can we... Yeah, we can use the boat to uh, destroy these. <laughs> oh, you did it. Okay, I was trying to do it too. Get in there. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my guy looks so panicked when he's in there. He's like, ah! Ooh, okay, hold up. Okay, there's a shield. Now we're max everything. Let's see what this other one is. Probably a puzzle piece. Probably. I okay, hope it is in. anyway, because that would be really helpful. Jump in the boat, you stupid CPUs! Good <laughs> lord! <laughs> the fucking boat! Oh yeah, it was. Uh, Sweet. Even better. Uh, I figured it would that be. wasn't a waste of time at all. No. <laughs> oh, we only need two characters to get in here. Oh. Good lord, he is really hard to control. I'm just trying to get on the platform. He's just like, I'm right? going to go all now these directions. See, now you see why I had so much trouble getting in the fucking cannons. <laughs> Holy Christ. Oh, oh, wait, I'm over here. Ow! Now I don't feel bad about juggling you, waddle dick. <laughs> yeah. That's just his brother, okay? He's taking revenge on you. <laughs> waddle dick his, and waddle dipshit. It's his brother's sister's cousin's girlfriend's wife, twice removed, <laughs> or something. His girlfriend, his sister, and his wife. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, wait, what did you just say? <laughs> oh, good old DDD. 
Oh yeah. The best arch nemesis you can get in a Kirby game. Oh yeah. I fucking love DD. It's Hammer of Doom. So what I love about Nintendo franchises, they have like the craziest character designs, but like they're so like I don't know, like they're so iconic in in certain ways. Like right? who who else would think of this? Like, right? This penguin. <laughs> And he just turns all buff too. And he just like, rips. He's got like he's he's got to work on them leg days though, man. He has like no legs. Oh yeah, right. <laughs> it's just his chest and arm day. That's basically all it is. He's like, you can lift, bro. All <laughs> yeah. I need is these arms. But then I guess if you wield a hammer all day, all you need is them arms. Yeah. Oh, Ow. we're on the same side. I didn't even realize. Aha! Just food at us. Gonna... Oh, Ow. God. We're just shredding through his health, so he's just going through all of his phases. Oh god. He's gonna kick me. There we nice. go. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta love smashing him around, his food just falls us everywhere. It stays in that <laughs> yeah. perfect pile. Exactly. Let's out all that <laughs> evil gas, too. <laughs> <laughs> That's where all of his muscles came from. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Just stocked up on evil gas. Protein first. Whoa, we got 17. Hey, there's another one complete. Yay! Whoa! I love that art style. That is cool. I like Kirby's face. He's like, huh? <laughs> Look at Gooey. He's just like, duh. Yeah. <laughs> His that reminds like me of a around. show of some sort, but I can't remember what it is right yeah, now. Yeah, that art style looks very familiar. Captain Underpants? Yeah, I think that's what it is. Yeah. yeah. Definitely. Oh, wow. We need a lot for that one. Oh, yeah. Are those the only two we have to finish? Oh, I no. Like... I guess I guess if it probably just adds on to like, the one puzzle at a time. Yeah. So, yeah, that's probably what it is. Yeah, so we'll probably just have, like, that one and that's it, maybe. Yeah, exactly. Okay. These episodes are going to be longer, by the way. We'll probably split this section, or, like, this uh, character specifically into two. So we hope you guys are all okay with that, because yeah. it'll be, like, 30 minutes or so. Oh, yeah. And then, because usually these take, like, an hour or so to get through, I think. And we'll try to figure out who we're going to choose next, because... Right. Yeah. Ow, I feel I like I kind of want to use Taranzia or like Susie or somebody. That would be fun. Some of the fun characters we had. Oh, I forgot. Whoa, hey! She just summoned like a little <laughs> 2D dwaddle or a 2D uh, DDD there. That was kind of cute. Ooh, do I switch to sweepers? Ooh. Oh, yeah, because you can use the vacuum, you oh, little yeah. shithead. <laughs> <laughs> when you stole all those points for me. Oh, yeah, <laughs> just wrecked During the, the world. credits or whatever. Do you want him? I think I do, yeah. Okay, well, you just find him. That yeah. works. Yeah. I know he's your favorite. He is. And I don't blame you because he's adorable and he, super overpowered. <laughs> he is extremely overpowered. I love the little thing. I just gotta remember how to use his, like, vacuum ability where you can, like, suck everything up. How does he see, though? He has no eyes. <laughs> I don't know. Or how, mouth, either. <laughs> how does a sheepdog do that? I know, right? Whoa, there we go. Sweet. Sweet, sweeping, sweeping away. Sorry, I'm just like flying ahead of everybody. That's okay, I can sweep. Ah, oh, don't no! sweep yourself into the abyss! <laughs> Not the abyss! <laughs> I can't clean nothing! <laughs> yeah. I was like, ah, fuck me! Sweep the air. Run oh, yeah, away. you can. Bye! Go away now. <laughs> Rise that up. So, ah! Oh, God, sorry. I keep like. The, he keeps flying so fast with this ability that it keeps like making you go off the screen. I'm right. so sorry. <laughs> Like, I, I need to stop going? dashing. <laughs> we. It's just so easy to get confused. Right? Oh my god, he can clean, but he has no legs to run! Right. Oh yeah, okay, so for some reason this just reminded me, since we went and saw Jumanji and stuff uh, the other day, which was awesome, by the way, if nobody's seen that. Okay. Um. Uh, did you see the trailer for the movie Free Guy with Ryan Reynolds? Uh, Free Guy, Free Guy. Oh yeah, I did. Yeah. Yeah, that looks so great. Like great. Like it's like this kind of like goofy GTA type of movie. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, this could either be really good or really like bad. But right, I feel yeah. like I feel like even if it's like not um like really really good, it's gonna be fun as fuck to watch. And that's like all I care about, because that's what I, why I go to movies most of the time. Yeah. Like, sure, I love like the really deep, like philosophical movies and stuff, but I also like really love just fun movies. Oh yeah. Like when I went when I saw the Rise of Skywalker, which is being just like lambasted. Oh yeah. Um, I actually had a lot of fun watching it. Like, it clearly has problems, like especially pacing problems. Um, it goes right. way too fast, and like stuff is just makes no sense half the time in the movie, right. but uh, I, I was just like, well, it's fun, whatever. Like, 
I've never really taken Star Wars that seriously, so... Right. But, yeah, I just, uh... Do you... Like, have you watched a lot of Star Wars before? Like, uh, I've watched a lot of the older ones, but then I just never got caught up in the new ones. Mm, right. Oh, hey, she's so making food for us. Nice! Still life. Yeah, I think probably because you guys need health the most, or especially you. Yeah, especially me, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna kiss your non-existent mouth. <laughs> Regurgitate your food onto me. Oh, yeah. I'm your baby bird. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> whoa! Okay, I was Where not expecting go? what just happened there. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck just happened? I didn't happened? think it was gonna work, too. Ooh, nice health. Yay! Up. Oh god! <laughs> that Please. just dropped, like, quicker than my balls in fifth grade. <laughs> I think I made that joke already before. I don't think you did, but I'm glad you made it. I feel like I've said that one time. <laughs> <laughs> ah, Jesus! I forgot about the wind! That's why I kind of hesitated when I said it. I'm like, this sounds familiar. <laughs> <laughs> For some reason. Ah! Sweepy. This oh god. Slow. No. I need the switch. Okay, there we go. Oh, everyone oh, needs hearts. a switch. Yeah. <laughs> you need one. I know you've been wanting to buy one for a while. I have, yeah. Stupid Wee, money slimy. getting in the way, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit, I need that to. That and the fact everything's, like, broken <laughs> right now. Oh, yeah. I gotta replace, like, two different things, and oh. so that's gonna take, like, all that. I got an iPad Air, though. Oh, cool. That's yeah. awesome. I need a case to get it. I need to put a case on it, though. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I don't want to break that shit. New. I like, I like how I was like, I want to buy, like, a TV on Boxing Day, and then my furnace broke down, like, at the start of winter, and it was freezing balls in my house for, like, four days. <laughs> we had to leave the oven on, Oh, and it cost God. me like twelve hundred dollars to fucking fix the stupid thing, and I'm oh, like, "Well, that sucks." I was like, "Great," and I got to pay off this. Right? <laughs> Happy Christmas to me, right? <laughs> or Merry Christmas to me. I mean, Ooh, I have an idea. Everybody in the vacuum. You have to burn the ice, though. I'm not getting in your fucking. No, I didn't <laughs> want to get in your vacuum. No. <laughs> I still smashed everything. You're giving me the big suck. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love that. Suck. What is this, Luigi's Mansion? <laughs> <laughs> right? Oh, wait, is this the puzzle with the fucking, like, thing we have to lead? Maybe. I feel like it is. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah it is. Okay, this one's not so bad, though. Yeah, this one we've done before. Yeah, oh, wait, we gotta bounce, bounce them off there. And then he goes to there, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, easy. I love how angry he looks, though, just carrying that key. Be that angry monkey. Ooh, nice power. He's like that, uh, story of the Monkey King. Oh, yeah. There was some Monkey King game that came out recently. Oh, uh, Enslaved, uh... No, it wasn't that. That came out, like, a long time ago. Oh, yeah, because um, I was gonna say, that was amazing. There was, like... No, it's like it's, I think it's just called The Monkey King. It's, like, kind of animated. Um, it, It's kind of, like, cartoony looking, anyway. I think I know what you mean, but I can't quite picture it right now. Yeah, it looks really cool, though. It does look really cool. I'm actually really excited for the Dragon Ball Z game coming out this month. Oh, uh, Kakarot. Because uh, yeah. it's an RPG, so I'm like, that sounds so cool. Like, there was... Um, these RPGs, uh, on the Super Nintendo and stuff, I guess technically the Super Famicom, because they only came out in Japan, right. for Dragon Ball, that were kind of, like, old-school, like, Dragon Quest, like, they were yeah. all in first-person and shit, and, like, some of them were card-based, um, and stuff like that, too. I guess, like, the, the legacy of Goku games were RPGs, too. Yeah. Like, they were more, like, over-the-top, uh kind of style um there was a they came out when i was in high school but this this one guy like really liked all of them oh because there was the first two and then boo's fury which was the third one Ooh. and he played the hell out of them um like so much he like on the game boy advance is is crazy he'd be talking about them like every day oh really and he's like you should really buy them and I think I ended up buying the second one, because apparently the first one's not very good, so I, I just kind of yeah. skipped past it, but right. um, they were really fun. Um, they kind of, like, gate uh, certain areas of the game off until you're at a certain level, ah. so you have to kind of grind for a bit. Okay, it makes sense. Yeah, and you can put stats in to different abilities and stuff like that, too. Oh. So you yeah, kind of had some customization. Uh, I actually own... I didn't mean to do that. Oh, yeah. I actually own this uh, this Dragon Ball RPG on uh, the DS called Attack of the Sands, which is oh. probably like one of the coolest Dragon Ball games I've ever played. I've actually heard of that. Yeah, it's it's like a it's like a turn-based RPG, okay. so it's kind of like Final Fantasy in a way. 
Oh, okay. Um, but it was created by Monolith Soft, the guys that created, uh, uh, the team that created, uh, Z Xenoblade Chronicles and, oh, okay. and all that stuff. And, I mean, I love every game they've ever made, so... Right. I was just so... Like, when I heard it was by them, I, I managed to see it, like, on a YouTube video or something, and I was like, that okay. looks so fucking good. So I immediately went to eBay, and I was like, oh, God, it's only 30 bucks, thank God. Yeah. I thought it was gonna be, like fucking eighty dollars or some shit at the time because it just wasn't well known so yeah. I thought maybe it was rare or whatever or something like that but you can never tell with games like that how yeah like how they're how expensive they're gonna be <laughs> oh yeah because like when I when I first played Xenoblade it was only it only came out in Europe so I had to mod my Wii just to play it and oh, I, I bought it online and I, I spent like an entire week playing that game straight. <laughs> oh god. And I, I think I put like a hundred hours into it in like that week alone or something. Because oh I was my just god. so obsessed with it. So That's I'm awesome, though. so I'm fucking excited that it's getting like a remake technically on the Switch this year. Oh that would sometime, be awesome. so Yeah a friend of mine he absolutely loves um the uh Dragon Ball games, the series, and he's actually excited about Kakarot. Oh, yeah. So he's he really wants to get it, and he thinks that I should get it, too. I'm just kind of, kind of hesitant, because I've never been a huge fan of, like, mm. Dragon Ball games. Oops, I didn't oh, mean to that. Oh, no. Gotta get your, your character back again. Ah, damn, oh well. Yeah. I can try her for a bit. She's actually a decent character, too. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, like... I can I can get that too because it's kind of like yeah I I used to be a big Dragon Ball fan um, when I was in high school or even like technically seventh eighth grade like when it got really popular yeah in, in America and stuff and like every week I was just like, so excited for a new Dragon Ball episode um, but yeah I kind of grown out of it as yeah. I got older because like it's just I don't know there's something about it like the growing power type thing like the I guess you can call it shonen anime, uh, is yeah. what it's called or something. I may be wrong about that. Somebody correct me in the comments if <laughs> if you know exactly the right term for it. Um, but yeah, like, I don't know, I kind of grew out of anime. I was really obsessed with it for a while, and then as I grew older, I just, for some reason, got into more serious type of movies, I guess. Right. Like, there's, it's, it's weird, though, because I say that, and I still love shows like Avatar The Last Airbender and stuff like that. Um... And some kid stuff too. Yeah, it's, it's some stuff you don't grow out of. Yeah, like, like I, I liked uh, Dragon Ball when I was like younger, kind of thing. But then yeah. I, I kind of got out of it when Cell kind of became a thing. Oh yeah. But that was mostly because like when I, I was like pretty young at the time, and he kind of freaked me out with the whole tail syringe thing. <laughs> oh yeah, that shit was weird. Oh my god. Just like drained everybody. Oh yeah, that was like a that was a big like nightmare fuel for me oh really yeah hmm. I, I wasn't a big fan of needles but that's because like when i was a kid i did like this allergy test and they used like a, a what i felt like was a really fucking big needle to like take my blood oh god okay and, and that was just like terrifying to me and that's what it kind of reminded me of right yeah it's kind of like when they fill a bag like of blood when you donate blood kind of thing but it was oh, like all yeah. in one shot so that's what it felt like. So when they showed scenes of like uh, Cell when he drained people right down to their clothes, that's kind of what it reminded me. Of. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, that that was pretty messed up to be honest. Like. Oh yeah. They, I'm pretty sure like it was probably worse than the Japanese version, like oh, how yeah. they went about that. Because I know it was more gory. Like they started releasing more like uncensored episodes um, as like I got older. Oh yeah. Um, like when I was probably in my twenties or whatever, they started releasing like DVDs with. Like, all the blood back on them and all oh, stuff. Oh, yeah. And then they started releasing, like, the Dragon Ball Z Kai episodes, which were, oh, like, yeah. kind of more akin to, like, the original airing of them. Oh, yeah. And stuff. They kind of redid some things in the story and all that stuff, too, so. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's Meta Knight right on. Oh, no. We've just been so busy talking, I just forgot what we were doing. <laughs> right. We're just kind of, like, going through the game. Yeah, like, there, there's been so many, like, Dragon Ball games I've played over the years, like, uh, Budokai, like the fighting games and all oh, that stuff yeah, too. Oh yeah, I remember that. Those were really fun. Oh, for sure. But yeah, I've especially gotten out of Dragon Ball because of the, all that stuff with Vic Mignogna going on right now. Um, because I, oh, yeah. yeah, the whole Funimation thing, I'm just like, yeah, I don't really want to support that shit anymore, so. Yeah. 
Like, I liked the company Funimation, but, like, they do some really good stuff that I actually really enjoyed. Right, yeah. Like, um, I think they did Helsing. Oh, uh, yeah, the vampire one, right? Yeah. Yeah. The ultimate one was, like, the original one I thought was pretty cool, but the one that really got me into it was, like, the <laughs> ultimate remake. Right, yeah. That one was I've awesome. heard that Helsing Ultimate is really good. Oh, it, it like, it changes kind of, like, the story. It's kind of like an alternate storyline kind of thing but they did so much better with it in that one. Oh yeah definitely because they did so much more stuff and like the like the original it was great as it is but in terms of like action kind of thing it definitely did something different with it oh that's good like um in the first one you definitely get like uh I, fuck, I forget the police girls um like twist of like I don't want to be a vampire but I'm a vampire now oh yeah but then you get like into the new one it's oh, like she accepts it a lot more and you get a whole bunch more like vampire style like fighting and stuff and I oh, think that was like cool. really cool yeah oh yeah I love like the the one thing I always respect about anime is like the fact that it's so creative like there's oh, been yeah. so many like things in anime that I've never seen in anything else before. Oh yeah. And and obviously like there's a lot of familiar things too between them. Yeah. But like some of the comedy stuff they do or like the ideas they have behind them. Like one of my favorite ones when I was younger, um, when they were releasing them like man, we, we used to have C D plus in Musha. Oh when this was when this came out. Um they would release this show called Gantz. Oh that was um that. yeah and uh, I, I fucking, like, couldn't wait till they released, like, more episodes on DVD and stuff, and, uh, I just, like, I love the idea behind it, it was, like, these people die, and they go, go into this room, and they have to fight aliens, and they have no idea what the fuck's going on, and it's, like, all serious and yeah. fucked up and, like, all this stuff, and, like, I was a teenager at the time, so, like, a lot of the nudity was really appealing to me. Oh, yeah. And all that <laughs> stuff, um, I used to watch that with, like... Uh, some of our co-workers, like, or, you know, because me and Jason and Andrew have been friends for so long. Oh, yeah. Um, we used to watch this together, and we all loved it. Uh, I mean, uh, Andrew was quite young compared to the rest of us, right. but, um, I know that he enjoyed watching it. And, like, I was with Chantel at the time, too, and she really enjoyed it as well. Yeah. Like, there were so many, like, surprises in that show, like, people getting killed off that I didn't expect and right, yeah. it was crazy like I and then it just kind of ended and I was like what the fuck happened like and uh and like I so I got into the manga which I have like quite a bit of them up there yeah and it, like the story continued it, it's over now like it's been long over oh yeah. shit oh you died didn't you I think I did oh yeah you got crushed shit. I did I think oh. you still join if you want like L and R together I, yeah I'm the monkey oh you're the monkey oh okay <laughs> right, sorry. um Ow. so I guess that's how we get these is the sword I didn't even realize that we could have just did that instead yeah um but yeah like it the manga is really good um the way it ended is really awesome uh so many creative ideas, like the alien designs were amazing. Oh yeah, for sure. Um, a lot of it like got more serious as it went on, like less less about like the nudity and like all that stuff uh, as it went further on, which is good because oh, I, mean, yeah. I know a lot of people were kind of like, "This is weird." Mm -hmm. Like the main character was really obsessed with that one girl, and yeah. looks kind of like a pervert towards her and stuff. Oh yeah. But yeah, I don't know it. It always appealed to me because it's really like gory and yeah, just kind of fucked up in some ways, and I love that fucked up shit. Yeah, the story was like really cool too. I, I hated that the damn it. I oh, hated that shit. the anime like just. Oh uh, shit! <laughs> I gotta go. Sorry. <laughs> That's fine. Sorry, you hate that the anime kind of ended where yeah, it was. yeah, where it was. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. I agree with that. Because that was like a whole new story. Like this, the stuff where it ended with him and the train and all that stuff was like completely different from like the the uh, continuation of the oh, the yeah. manga. Like, I think one of the aliens like ends up attacking his school at oh. one point or something like that in the manga, and that would have been way more interesting. Oh yeah. So yeah. That would have been awesome. Ow. But uh, yeah, I really wish they would have like continued at least for a little bit longer. Yeah. 
It's cool that we did get a movie like quite a few years ago. Like the, oh, yeah, the I think CGI. it was like the CGI one. That was really awesome. Yeah, I still gotta watch that. Yeah, it seems like it would be like so cool. Oh yeah, it definitely is. It's 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 very like much like the anime. So I bet. There's like one particular story that makes no sense, like where some chick falls in love with one of the guys, one of the main characters, uh, Kato, I think it is. Oh, okay. Um, like, just out of nowhere, like, they know each other for like half of a day, and she's just like, because he saved her or something, she's just like in love with them practically. <laughs> it was just so strange. It made no sense, but I'm like, well, that's Gantz. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Oh, I was gonna bring him oh. to our side. That's alright. Oh. Oh wait, I guess you gotta get in my boat. Get in the boat. I'm on a boat! <laughs> I'm on a boat! Man, that's a throwback. <laughs> oh yeah. Fucking love Lonely Island. They were uh, so no. funny. Yeah, they were so great. I wish they did more stuff. Do they still do stuff? Uh, I'm not sure, actually. It's been so long since I've seen Saturday Night Live, I have no idea. Yeah. Ooh, Me hearts. too. I, I think Andy Samberg's just been busy doing other stuff. I know they, like... I know they're still doing things, but it's probably just not as often anymore. Yeah, because I think they're still doing uh, Brooklyn Nine-Nine, if I remember right. Yeah, I thought it ended, actually. I thought it, well, I still had, like, a season that's uh, airing, I think it is. Oh, okay. But I don't know if that's, like, an older season. Th yeah, it might be, like, the final one, because I, th I think my sister watches that show, like, religiously. Uh, um, not religiously, that's a kind of weird thing to say. <laughs> but she, like, she really likes it, and uh, she said that I think this this season was supposed to be the final one. Ah, I believe so, anyway. Okay, we need electricity. Yes, we do. And Good thing is. there's a little plug up there. <laughs> How convenient! Yeah. So we gotta destroy that thing. Oh. Get in my boat! Okay, I'll just throw him at okay, it, whatever. Too. There. And now, I think we can... Maybe he'll do it for us? I don't know, I don't even know. Are you gonna do it? Yeah, oh, okay, never mind, okay, I can just do that. There. Wee! Oh wait, I thought I was you for a second. Shit, <laughs> that was really stupid. Here we go. We're in. We have a like, twenty-two lives already. <laughs> nice. Jesus. Progress. Megalor is so overpowered that it makes this so easy. It does. <laughs> <laughs> These masks. I don't like them. They're scary. They are. They. It's eternal evil. Like scary mists. Oh, no. no, come back! I really want to watch The Mask again with Jim Carrey. Oh, that is such, that was like my all-time favorite movie as a kid. Yeah, it's actually like top five for me, my favorite movies of oh, all time. Yeah. Uh, Did you ever see Son of the Mask? No. Okay. Because I heard it was bad, so I just didn't I, bother watching it. I thought it was too, and I just never seen it, and I just... The very idea, like, did not appeal to me. No, no, definitely not. Because it's like... Why? And it's not even Jim Carrey. Like, why the fuck would I watch this? <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, Jamie Kennedy, whatever. Like, nothing against the guy. It's just not the same. Yeah. And, like, I get Jim Carrey didn't want to do it, and that's fine. I get it. Um, he probably, like, read the script or something, or they probably tried to get him to work on it, but it was so long after the original movie that he was just like, I'd lost interest, probably. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. I mean, it's gonna like I'm really excited for the Sonic the Hedgehog movie just to see him in another movie. Yeah. Um, because I don't even know how how long it's been since I've seen him in one. Yeah. Like it's, a lot of the stuff you like if you search Jim Carrey movies, a lot of them is like the older stuff from the '90s. Right. Yeah. And then you see him. He was in a really serious one. The last one I remember. Right. Number twenty three, I think it was. Oh yeah, I saw that in theaters. That was such a like, ridiculous movie. <laughs> oh, nice, thank you for saving me. She was about to skew, skabob you, yeah. me on that. <laughs> skabob. The skabob. I mean, kabob me on it. <laughs> I like the skabobs. <laughs> Alright, well, I think we should end the episode here. We'll finish okay. the rest of the stages in the next one. Okay. So, uh, we hope you guys enjoyed this, just our rambling on and on about stuff. I, li stuff. I like playing this game because we can just talk about whatever. Yep. It's a lot of fun. Oh, yeah. But yeah, uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you tomorrow for a new episode. Have a great day as always. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.